Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Back in April of this year, I let you know that if you are using Office 2016 and 2019, that according to Microsoft, you would have had six months left of support. And we had a look at some options, and I'll leave that video linked um, if you'd like some additional information. Now, just to let you know that Microsoft now, on the 15th of September, has now issued an announcement that you have only one month left until Office 2016, 2019 end of support. Are you ready? With Microsoft once again saying, continuing to use software after end of support can leave your devices vulnerable to potential security threats, productivity losses, and compliance issues. That's why Microsoft says it's important to know that in just one month, on October 14, 2025, well, it's a little bit less now than a month at the time of posting this video, support will end for both versions of Office, and that will be the 2016-2019 Office suits, standalone applications, and servers. After that date, Microsoft says it will no longer provide security fixes, bug fixes, or technical support for these products. So just giving you a friendly reminder that you are one month out if you are using 2016 and 2019 of Office. Now, Microsoft's so-called recommended path forward after that date is it's cloud powered by Microsoft 365, which obviously is a subscription based Office replacement that Microsoft claims is AI ready thanks to 365 Copilot. Now, obviously, Microsoft would love everybody to move over to a subscription based plan and for obvious reasons and i think though that copilot and ai are not everybody's so-called cup of tea but that's where microsoft wants you to go check the other video out i posted back in april it will also give you some additional information regarding prices and so on and the reason microsoft says it's recommending microsoft 365 is its cloud-based service offers things like automatic updates ongoing support better security and more and microsoft also says from the announcement that for customers and devices that cannot or cannot yet move to the cloud it recommends upgrading to the most recent supported on-premises version of office for commercial customers which is office ltsc 2024 microsoft says that the office long-term servicing channel is designed for devices that cannot accept feature updates or connect to the internet so basically that's also another option if you do find yourself in an enterprise environment. So one month left of support for Office 2016 and 2019. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.